from Schollmeyer Arena in Fort Worth, Texas. Number six, Kansas, coming off their worst home loss in the Bill Self era and playing without Marcus Garrett tonight, are on the road as they battle TCU, the Horned Frogs, who have won their last five in a row. Well, he, he doesn't need to be Jacques Vaughn tonight, but he just needs to be a solid floor general. And a quick and three is from a good start, Baji. Mark Neely. Her gives it to Let's McCormick, see. and now out for a three is short from Wilson. David Brown McCormick saves it that, for Kansas, but yeah, he got that ball five feet from the basket, Mark. He's got to go up with that. Laid in by Chuck O'Bannon. Fuller on the move, sealed off there. That goes out O'Bannon once again, and the USC oh, transfer off to a nice start for TCU tonight. The assist tonight in his first career start. Has three nice. assists already, and there's a feed from Brown yep. to McCormick in the lob. Dan and Dick, thanks very much. We welcome those of you that have been watching the North Carolina two-point win over Miami. Mark Neely along with Fran Fraschilla. He's got no fear. That's the one thing we saw early in the year against Kentucky, no fear. Averaging 15 points to lead the Jayhawks, and no fear for Nimard, whose first shot of the game, he knocks down a three. Lost it. That's Kansas's first turnover tonight. Here's Samuel down low, able to pass it out for Nimhard. Nimhard on the drive, scoop and oh, swing, and the foul. Better player when, uh, when the lights are off in the arena. That's too sloppy there by Christian Brown. Another turnover. Kansas is second. Here's a Watch lob out. and a Watch stuff out. by Kevin Samuel. It's earlier this year. That's, even that Kentucky game when he played a career high 25 minutes. So there's a stuff by Kevin Samuels. So they've gotten a couple of buckets from their big 6'11 junior tonight. Yeah, I, I thought I thought he was I thought Harris was there's a nice drive. Look at that finish. You talk about downhill. Brown. That's downhill on roller skates right there. Here's a drive. Harris. Fuller feeds O'Bannon, who had a couple of key shots oh, yeah. early in the game and drains another there. He has 10 first half points. In a row on the floater. No, that's a lob for Lightfoot. Yep. <laughs> uh oh. Good Nim Hart. Good, good, good drive. Good finish. A dozen points for Nim Hart. Kansas. Apache got it off in time, but it's short and a 14 point lead. For the Jayhawks, it's just about to go there with you. I mean, yep. rebounding, he's one of the top rebounders in the conference. In fact, is number one. And so Baji drains a three, his third of the night. What's the lob? Wow. On the yep. receiving end, Abaji this time. You know, what, you know what we call that? An easy basket. It gets an easier basket against the zone than they've gotten against the man. Uh, this is a TCU team that comes in with a five-game winning streak, and it's a pretty big uphill battle here. David McCormick, or at least he has to be on the floor for us. And we're seeing that tonight from him. And rolled off the foot of Taryn Todd, a TCU turnover, and the other way, the shovel good for Abaji. Against the Red Raiders, really rock solid. Hit that big three down the stretch as well. And this is only the second true road game for Kansas, the other being the one the in drive. Lubbock. And a lob to Abaji in the Kansas offense tonight, even without Marcus Garrett, Hummy. is absolutely rolling. A really solid player for us. Deep three, knocked down by Chuck O'Bannon. How about Chucky O'Bannon with the added to the career high? And Mark Few made a great point that Bill Self has made to me on a number of occasions. Our kids love going on the road and quieting a road crowd come back and play two more years besides this year because of the free year the yeah. NCAA is offering these guys and I would do it I would certainly do it downhill watch out Wilson driving again and McCormick comes crashing in get downhill and that time David McCormick was cleaning up the miss by the way Mark, yeah how about his career high? 18 yeah. And they're really just kind of think, even with tonight, uh, a bit of a bump in the road, this is a team that seems like it's starting to hit its stride. They went at 93 to 64 over TCU, and Kansas improved to 3-1 in conference play. They won 11 straights.